Hello friends, this is the West Coast Math Tutor. Today we are going to start with trigonometry. The study of trigonometry depends on the concept of angles. So in this video we are going to start with some basic terminology, like angle, initial side, terminal side, vertex positive angles, negative angles, standard position, quadrant angle and coterminal. As we know, we get an angle by rotating a ray about its endpoint. In other words, we measure angles by determining the amount of rotation needed for the initial side to become coincident with the terminal side. The two commonly used measures for angles are degrees and radians which I will explain in the next videos, so stay tuned. We call the starting point of the ray the initial side of the angle, and the position after the rotation, the terminal side. The end point of the ray is the vertex, of the angle. When an angle is in the xy plane and when its vertex is at the origin and the initial side is along the positive x-axis, then we say that the angle is in standard position. When an angle alpha is in standard position, the terminal side will either lie in a quadrant in which case we say that alpha lies in that quadrant or the terminal side will lie on the x-axis or on the y-axis. In which case we say that alpha is a quadrant angle. Positive angles are generated by counterclockwise rotation and negative angles by clockwise rotation. When angles have the same initial and terminal sides, then the angles are called coterminal. Lowercase Greek letters such as alpha beta gamma and theta as well as uppercase letters as a, b and c will often be used in denote angles. More to come, so stay tuned. And if you like my videos, like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching and happy learning everyone.